Eastern Kentucky softball season wasn't supposed to go this way at all, but that's actually a good thing because the Colonels were picked to finish ninth in the A Sun during the preseason. Now they hold the number one seed in the conference tournament. Um, I actually had high hopes for this year. Yay! I feel like we expected to win a lot of ball games this year. And that's no surprise to them, but a 40 and 8 record, 17 game winning streak, and a double buy in the A Sun postseason don't come often. EKU had that many wins or more just once in the past decade in 2018. Percentage wise, this is still better. A Sun head coach of the year, Jane Worthington. You want a water Say grab that. it real quick? New success was written in the stars, too. Everybody asked me, like, when did you know this team was going to be special? And it really was during the recruiting process of the, of the freshmen. One of those newbies, a Sun pitcher and freshman of the year, Maddie Rattan, is 23 and 4 in the circle. And having confidence in myself and knowing I can't do it all myself as a pitcher or a hitter. So just having my team behind me and having confidence in my team has just been the biggest part. She's one of three Colonels on the A-Sun All-Freshman team and one of eight team members to earn 14 different conference honors. But these girls don't care about me, only we. And everyone comes together and we play like we're actually a family and not just like a bunch of girls, like a bunch of individuals. We play as like as one and I think that's what makes it so special. That's because the mission is to send off seniors like Conference Player of the Year Janae Riley the right way. Yeah, this is my last year and I'm just grateful. You know, I just feel very, very grateful for this opportunity. The Colonels will play their first game of the ASUN tournament versus either Florida Gulf Coast, Austin P, or North Alabama on Thursday at 1.30 Eastern. In Richmond, I'm Forrest Tucker, ABC 36 Sports.